So it is very sad, but it is time to open the last part of my Sun Moon booster box. So this is the only Sun Moon packs that I've purchased so far, just because uh, I'm quite tight on money at the moment. I do have an extra four packs that I'll be opening, hopefully outside, in some outside opening. Hopefully the weather can get a bit better for me to do that. And maybe I'll keep two of them for a pack battle. But for now we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight packs. Still to go over rings, guys. So, uh, since last opening we have found out that, of course, the booster... Actually, I'm going to mix these up because, yes, it's mapped. We know it's mapped, so we're just going to get two non-hollows and a hollow. So let's absolutely randomize these. And uh, hopefully Pokemon can reprint it and sort their stuff out because I have that's one of the reasons I haven't got any other Sun Moon boosters because there's a local place where I can pick it up from a booster box in WH Smith but now I just can't trust single booster boxes. I saw one of the packs upside down in their booster box and I was like no way someone's put that back. So here we have eight sealed uh, packs and randomized now of Sun and Moon for my last part. So we have got some fantastic pools that are showcased at the back there for you to see. I'll give you this first code, but I'll keep the rest for myself because as I say, I haven't had any other product for myself. And we'll get straight into it. I guess it was four and two. Gosh, I haven't done this in a few weeks. As I said, I haven't got much other Sun and Moon. So we have a bounce suite. I have been loving this set though. Lily Pup, Paris, Fero, Lin, A, Fighting Energy, Double Colorless Energy, nice. Pukumuku, I'm just about getting that right. Proc Rock, a Team Skull Grum, nice, nice. And a Lantern. So, Team Skull Grum, I, I'm not sure what I make of that full art. It's, it's okay. I mean, Team Skull in general to me are just a bit cheesy. But I guess some people like them. To me, Team Rocket, like, ooh, we might have something here that felt, that felt nice, that felt good. Um, but yeah, Team Rocket, Jesse James, yeah. and Giovanni are the original OGs to me. So we have a Litten, ooh, Young Goose, Sanskrit, Fire Energy, Pokemon Catcher, Golbat, Poliwhirl, Persimian, and an Incineroar, GX. Very, very nice. So I wasn't even expecting this. That is a really nice marbling uh, hollow pattern on the GX. I do like that. So let's get this a sleeve very quickly. So I have been absolutely loving these GX cards. Um, I really enjoy them. And uh, the full arts, I, uh, I really love in this set too. And the rainbow rares, they're just amazing. And then the secret rares, oh gosh. So very cool. Oh, it's very windy, so uh, I thought someone was knocking on the door, but it's just the wind. And one, two, three, four, one, two. So we have a Chin Chu, more Lulls, Skarmory, Caterpie, Sandigast, Unlisted Leaf, Daytrix, Dartrix, Pudgeon Mouth, Hardier. Poison Pop, I don't think I have this reverse, and a Bruxish. So we are getting some reverse trainers, which is nice because that, that helps with the completion of the master set. And we'll get into another pack. So let me know how now, I guess it's about a month down the line, uh, how your Sun and Moon experience has been, what your favorite cards you've pulled, and uh, Makahita what you're looking forward to them doing in the rest of Sun Moon sets. Charger Bug. That reminds me of um, my neighbor Totoro, the, uh, the bus. Anyway, the cat bus, Rotom decks, Nestle, side up, very, very nice, and a Cosmo. So, we are halfway through, guys. I'll speed this up a little. And I'm sure you've seen these comments many times before now. One, two, three, four. One, two. So 
So we will speed this up with the Grimer. Took it to Mark. Loves him. That Stuffle. Marini. Dupider. Pretty Pider. Darkness Energy. Spinder. Lima. Simeon. A Butterfree. Rare. Which I might have. And oh, we got a Sharpedo. Hollow as well. So if that had been a pet butter, that would have had some points in it. Now we'll get into the last three packs. One, two, three, four, one, two. And we have a Skarmory again, Caterpie again, Sandy Gas, Rog and Roller, Cosmo, Psychic Energy, very nice, Pinsir, Metapod, Gramble, a Litten, a List of Kittens, and Beware of the Bear. Beware of Beware. And we have two packs left. Two Incineroar GX packs. Can we get anything out of them? So of course we do have the other further four packs. Do you notice that first card is damaged? Has been damaged. There's been. Let me see if I can find. Can see there you see it right there. I mean it's only in the commons and I've forgotten the card trick, but uh, it's quite frustrating. Pokemon, come on. Side up, Spira, Dratini, Cutie Fly, Pal of Sand, which is a rare, and a Stoutland. Ultra Ball. <gasps> I got the Ultra Ball guys, oh my gosh. Um, Sun and Moon, last pack, last box. Not the last chance for glory, because I did say I do have those four packs. But uh, let us see. We have a Paras, Firo, Litten, Young Goose, Surge Threat, Lightning Energy, Energy Switch, Trumbreak, Corsola, a Cosmog, and another Palosand. So I believe we got the, yeah, them in alternate packs, but uh, nothing too wild in this last part. We did, of course, get this awesome Incineroar GX to be happy about. And we do have some very cool cards in the background. There is also a special package that I will be opening on Monday that is very sun moon themed as well. So I look forward to that, guys and I hope you all have a great weekend. Leave a like. And Roaring Skies, Roaring Skies, tomorrow, a whole box, shaman giveaway. Be there or be square.